What's good guys, if you guys want the most cheap and most reliable EAFC24 coins, make sure you guys check out u7buy.com and make a purchase. Next time you guys also want to make a purchase, use the code DAN to get 6% off on making that team better. Also on the same website, if you ever want to sell your coins, you click on the help center and click on the selling section. Yo YouTube, what's going on? Welcome to another video to the channel, y'all yeah, boys. And today we're going to go ahead and review the 90 newly released team of the group stage hero card it's going to be abby d pele 5-9 medium medium work rates double four star on the skill moves and weak foot with the left foot acceleration type is explosive 92 pace 85 shooting 88 passing 92 dribbling 68 physicality finesse shot incisive pass long ball pass flare acrobatic quick step and wrap it on gold so a lot of traits this abd pele has and some really good ones as well now i'm going to be completely honest i'm going to give him the hunter chemistry style you max out that pace you definitely got to boost up the shooting because 82 finishing is kind of low for an attacker so it goes up to 90 shot power goes up to 89 attack position goes up to 89 as well everything in the dribbling category looks absolutely amazing 96 agility 91 balance 93 ball control i expect this card to feel nice and responsive on the ball even in terrible gameplay abd palette is going to be playing with this team right here our rtg in case you guys don't know and we're going to be playing this card down the wing in a 4-3-2-1 as a right forward right behind that eusebio card now by the time i'm recording this video this card literally just dropped about 20 minutes ago and he's oh shit, he crashed he's a little over 2 million coins i expect this card to settle Around the 1 million coin mark, I'll be really surprised if he's over 1.5 million coins. But I'm going to be completely honest. He looks really, really meta. Good traits, good stats with the dribbling and pace. We're just going to have to see if the shooting is a liability. We're going to play some foot champs, and hopefully his ABD play cooks for us. Here we go with game number one, y'all boys. Let's see what type of team. And that team is pretty meta. It's pretty meta. It's pretty meta. Nothing crazy. Oh yeah, he's very, very quick, yeah, boys. Very, very quick on the sticks. Little shot cancel pen. Great play created from Abby D. Pele right there. I'm going to go ahead and shoot with the card himself. I'm going to go top left. Hopefully, we do not choke. Nice. Good finish right there. It's a good pass. Test out that finishing. He did move the goalkeeper right there. Holy shit. Good thing I didn't choke that. But great positioning so far from Mr. Pelé. I could have given that ball to Mbappe right there. I don't know how this guy is not getting scored on right now. Pele. Nice. Good finish right there inside the box. We do take that. Very good step over right there. Keeps onto the ball. That's nice. He was able to keep onto the ball, man. I thought he was going to lose that because the physicality is not that great, but good stuff. Oof. Oof. That step over, man. That step over from ABD is absolutely fire. Good finish with the weak foot that time as well. Good pass from Killian. Great pass and a good low driven shot. Mr. Pele. That was nice. Good play right there. Great left stick dribbling. Great left stick dribbling. And that's a pen. Let's go. We got kind of bailed right there because we did miss. We're obviously going to shoot it with the man himself. 
Uh, straight down the middle. Let's go 1-0. Let's take it. A good find to ABD Pelé right there. Great step over to stop that. Oh, fuck. I choked it. I choked it right there. I choked it. That was nice. That R1 dribbling. Absolutely amazing, yeah, boys. No CB was able to stop him that play. And a good finish as well. Oof. Good first time finish right there. I'm not going to lie. I thought that wasn't going to go in because Van der Sar kind of covered the angle. But good finish. Good ball control. Little Travella inside the box. And that is another good finish from Mr. Pele. Let's go. Good step over. Mmm. Good finish with the weak foot. Okay, okay. That was nice. Great find. Your post. That is tough, man. That's tough. Damn, he hit the post right there. That's tough. One more opportunity. This time with the weak foot. So, it's kind of weird, man. The finishing in this game. It's back and forth, but we do take that. Alright, boys. And that concludes the review for 90 rated UEFA Heroes of Men's. Team of the Group Stage card. Abidi Pele, I don't know if it's team of the group stage, but it's a UEFA Heroes card. And he's coming around 975,000 coins by the time I'm dropping this video. 3.1 million coins on the PC. That's actually crazy because literally when I got his loan, he was 3 million coins. And in the span of one hour, he's dropped <laughs> over 2 million coins, which is kind of insane. But obviously with this card, we played 6 games with him, 12 goals, 1 assist as a right forward in a 4-3-2-1 formation. A really, really good return. Let me go over what I liked about the card and what I didn't like, because there is some things I don't like from the card, obviously. Number one is that his pace is exceptional. Pace, combination with the rapid on plus. Quick step, he's one of the quickest cards I've used in EFC 24 Ultimate Team, and that says a lot because a lot of quick players this year. And with this ABD Pelé, him being super quick, with the insane dribbling, guys. Insane dribbling. The dribbling is the best aspect from this card. 96 agility, 91 balance, 92 reactions, 93 ball control. He feels super clean, left stick dribbling, croquetta, step overs. Don't even get me started on the step overs. Oof. One of the best I've used this here for sure. A tag position is actually really underrated because he has a medium, medium work rates. Some of you guys might see that as a con, but I feel like that attack position going up to 89 with the Hunter chemistry style helps out the card be in the right spot at the right moment. If you have this card on get him behind, stay central, you don't have an issue with the medium medium work rates personally for me. Now, if you don't have him on get him behind, you might see him being static at times. Finishing is quite interesting because he has 12 goals in six games. He has four star weak foot and 82 finishing is not exactly ideal, but it goes up to 90 with the Hunter chemistry style. So for me, it's solid, but it's not top tier. There were a couple misses that I didn't like, but at the same time, there were a couple chances that he did score that I thought he wasn't going to score. He did a way better job. I'm not going to lie. He did pretty decent in some aspects. So it's either in the mixed category for me or decent enough, but not a major pro. Now, a con I will say from the card is the physicality. The physicality from this card, absolutely horrific. 67 strength, 48 aggression with his body type being 5'9". He's getting body off the ball relatively easily. I'm sorry, guys. That's just a fact. So you play this card down the wing or at striker, be on the lookout if he's going against big boy CBs. Another con from the card is that he's double four. For me, that's a personal con. I prefer my attackers with five-star skill moves, if not at least five-star weak foot but he doesn't have either one so a little limited in that aspect but if you're somebody that likes to play very simple spam step overs running a straight line tiki taka one two five-star skill moves him not having it is not going to be an issue overall i think he's a really meta card definitely makes the argument for a top 10 winger in the video game uh, off the top of my head i can't put him there but he definitely makes the argument because of how quick and his creativity down the wing he's gonna get a thumbs up for me and rating wise for Mr. Wefa Heroes Pele, he's gonna 8.5 out of 10. Solid enough 
but not enough to get into that top tier range in my opinion one of the best cards in efc 24 that's double four i will say he's up there with Henri and those type of cards obviously Henri being better but you know samuel eto and those type of big boys right there but thank you guys once again that concludes the review for this card the next video i'm going to be dropping i'm not exactly sure i'm going to try my best to review some top tier team of the group stage cards Till next time, it's been your boy Dan FIFA, and I am out. Bye-bye.